right, so here we go with round one. Seems to be a situation in which he wants to do everything in his power to keep this fight on the feet. He would appear to have a lot of advantages at distance. We'll see if he can get it done tonight. Yes, he has all the advantages because we don't see many specialists anymore in the UFC. Guys can generally do everything, but this guy is a jiu-jitsu player. He wants to get the fight to the ground and start to leave his web of traps to try and find a submission. This striker needs to maintain his space. He needs to make sure he is not on the ground, avoid it at all costs. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High level grappling can really be entertaining. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Oh, nice jab. Oh, there's a takedown attempt, unable to get the fight to the ground. Nice job by the opponent. Nice job by the opponent defending the takedown, but now he is going to have to mix it up again. The first shot will not work. He's got to go one, two, three at a time to try to overwhelm him to give him too much to process to try to get this fight to the ground. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? A big head kick. Continues to mix. All right, so he lands his first takedown of the fight after many failed attempts. So he stayed committed. Now he has the fight in his wheelhouse. Let's see what he can do. He lands with the kick there. No pat on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws. Just misses with that one. Man, the takedowns have come in bunches tonight, and there is another one. That was his strategy coming in. He has executed to perfection. It never works out perfectly, but today it seems to be going as great as it can be. I know the takedowns don't look beautiful. They don't look good. Now he has a headlock trying to pin his opponent's back down flat onto the mat. Look for him to transition to an arm triangle to try to chase the finish. There he is. He's moving to the finishing position. Now watch he goes parallel right next to his opponent. When it's time to finish. Oh, he might have got him with a choke. submission there just as the horn sounded safe to say he was saved by the bell there so back to the stools they go sick all right dc second round is getting underway hey, no, round one not the round of the year necessarily so it's good in and it's not always gonna be when you have two very talented fighters sometimes it's very even that's what we saw in round number one big punch lands over the top how's he gonna follow this oh nice connection Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Oh! Oh, straight right! Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's thrown. I mean, punches in bunches. He's doing a great job. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing, Muscle. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. He's able to slip the left. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well that he dropped a big... That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Man. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. And we got a fight on our hands. Wow. What a fight. Wow. He needs to start looking to finish now.
because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, huge right hand! Oh, the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way. The referee's going to stop this. He better start to move. And when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very dangerous position. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Nice loop and punch. Down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Way to hide that leg. And that one certainly found the target. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. His leg is hurt here, you can see that. Oh, and that one snapped the head back. The referee has seen enough. Burner by TKO. He mercifully stopped the fight. A great stoppage and a great performance by this young man. Inside the octagon. 